Item Number SCP-1322-J Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures As SCP-1322-J is effectively self-containing, minimal security is required. The break room is to be shut down indefinitely and restricted solely for testing. Testing is currently focused on gaining access to SCP-1322-J-1. Should a site containment breach of a dangerous anomaly or anomalies occur, extra guards will be assigned to prevent access to SCP-1322-J-1. Description SCP-1322-J is a space-time anomaly 2 meters in height and 1 meter across located in Site-27's break room, leading to a parallel universe designated as SCP-1322-J-1. SCP-1322-J appears to lead to an alternate Foundation Site-27 break room. SCP-1322-J-1 appears to be identical to baseline reality, except for its chiral nature. Due to this effect, it is currently impossible for personnel to enter SCP-1322-J-1, as their chiral counterparts will block them from entering. Attempts to collaborate with SCP-1322-J-1 instances will prove fruitless from what appears to be a result of its anomalous chiral nature, and meaningful communication will prove impossible. SCP-1322-J was discovered by researcher Cameron Barnes, who proceeded to immediately alert security to the presence of an unknown anomaly. Currently, Barnes is in charge of containment. Test 1. Success negative. Action taken. Researcher Barnes attempted to enter SCP-1322-J. Result. Researcher Barnes collides with SCP-1322-J-1-Barnes. Barnes attempts to enter the anomaly for 23 minutes, but is blocked by SCP-1322-J-1-Barnes. Testing ends after SCP-1322-J-1-Barnes becomes aggressive. Test 2. Success negative. Action taken. Mobile Task Force A-15, codenamed Chess Players, is ordered to enter SCP-1322-J by any means necessary. Result. Mobile Task Force A-15 immediately entered hand-to-hand -hand combat with their counterparts. As expected, neither version of Mobile Task Force A-15 made any progress. Testing was abandoned after Mobile Task Force A-15 deployed grenades, resulting in three members requiring hospitalization. Test 3. Success negative. Action taken. A drone is deployed toward SCP-1322-J. Result. The drone is blocked by the alternate drone. Test 4. Success negative. Action taken. A drone, D1, is taped on top of another drone, D2, and sent towards SCP-1322-J at 60 km per hour in the hopes that the impact will throw D1 into SCP-1322-J-1. Result. D1 is dislodged by D2's impact and thrown towards SCP-1322-J-1, but is blocked by its counterpart that experienced a matching flight pattern. Test 5. Success Affirmative. Action taken. D-23432 is ordered to enter the portal on pain of immediate termination. Result. D-23432 appeared confused about SCP-1322-J, insisting it was not anomalous. D-23432 refused to enter SCP-1322-J. Updated SCP Designation Item Number SCP-1322-J Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures SCP-1322-J is to be removed from the break room and put in secure storage. Description SCP-1322-J is an indestructible mirror. In approximately 92.9832123% of humans, subjects are convinced that it is a portal to a highly interesting alternate universe. Ida, I'd like to offer my immediate resignation. Researcher Barnes.